And those military veterans suffer from post-traumatic stress disorder or PTSD. And in the case of one former Houston Marine, PTSD actually forced him to hit rock bottom and even contemplate suicide. But tonight, thanks to intervention in a very special program, he's on the road to recovery and providing inspiration to other veterans. Channel 2's Brandon Walker live now at Camp Hope in Northwest Harris County with this amazing story. Brandon, good evening. It is an amazing story, Jonathan, and welcome to Camp Hope here. It's an affiliate of the PTSD Foundation of America. For so many troops who return home from combat with PTSD, they often feel helpless. This program works to change that. That was the case for Craig Schrader, who today graduated. If I could have everybody's attention. Behind these doors, <laughs> on the other side of dinner time shuffle. It's always a great night when we get to hand out a certificate. A chance to say thank you even more. It's about giving back. Good job for fighting the fight when at times it felt a struggle uphill. Craig Schrader knows that battle cry. Tonight he is front and center, graduating from a program he says saved his life. I got to uh, a point where I didn't know if I wanted to go on. Schrader's path begins as a member of the U.S. Marines. He served his country for four years, some of that time deployed to Iraq. Like many who served, Schrader returned home. Battle scars unseen lingered. I was having some depression issues. I was isolating a lot um, and withdrawing from normal society because of depression and, and PTSD and, and all these uh, things, uh, anxiety. He became suicidal, he says, hitting rock bottom one day in January. Police had to be called. Good thing they were. He was the beginning of, of a process that um, got me back on track. He was Sergeant Steve Cruz, Harris County Precinct 5. Sergeant Cruz helped Schrader get here, Camp Hope in Northwest Harris County. And our main uh, priority here is suicide prevention of combat vets. Sergeant Craig Hawthorne is Craig Schrader's mentor, an alum too of the six month long program. PTSD is live and well. Uh, I have it, he has it. A lot of combat vets are, uh, have it, but we don't seek the support upon ourselves. Camp Hope and those who partake aim to change that. Crash Schrader among them. It's everything behind these gates that goes on that, that really makes the difference. Fighting long after the battle may have seemed to end. I'm helping. You know, I, I'm just one, one voice and one person, but there's a lot that goes in behind the scenes here to make it happen. A lesson in humility, too. Schrader's family was here, too, and they were all smiles to see him graduate. Now he says he's going to go back to his job in the insurance agency, but he's not giving up and he's not forgetting about what this program did for him. He says he hopes to do the same for those who are going through this program and hope to graduate as he did today. We are live tonight in Northwest Harris County. I'm Brandon Walker, KPRC Channel 2 News. And we hope that's the case. Thanks a lot, Brandon. Whether you are a veteran or not, if you or someone you know is contemplating suicide or self-harm, we do have information on how to get help. Just look for Brandon's story on our homepage.